Investigators are on the scene of an officer-involved shooting inside a gated community. CBS 2's Cara Finstrom is live at the scene on Sardinia Way near Trapani Lane with details. Cara? Sharon, police say they got a 911 call that someone had been stabbed and rushed out to the gated community that you see behind us here. They say officers quickly found a woman bleeding who was lying outside. She was rushed to the hospital and is expected to be okay. Take a look at what we saw a short time later from Sky to paramedics trying to help what appears to be the suspect there. The man on the gurney was handcuffed to it. Sergeant Barry Montgomery tells us it appears the man and woman had a relationship of some sort and had argued. Uh, that this does not look like a random break in. He also tells us a knife was recovered by officers and that none of the responding officers were hurt. All this started at around 10 30 last night. Here's what the sergeant said about what led up to those shots being fired. Officers gave numerous commands for him to drop that knife. However, he failed to comply. It was then that officers deployed less lethal munitions, the beanbag shotgun and a taser. Unfortunately, both uh, proved ineffective. At some point, the suspect advanced towards the officers, and that's when our officer involved shooting occurred. And we're told that suspect is in the hospital, but it's in stable condition. Now, we've watched detectives come and go uh, from this gated community all morning long. Jeff and Sharon, there are also force investigators out here this morning. And we are told that uh, this does qualify for that new protocol that we talked about yesterday, where any body cam video, any dash cam video uh, that officers collect will be released to the public within 45 days and perhaps provide a little bit more insight into what happened here with that use of force.